In round three, our experts will answer two questions, this time for $5 a piece. And while they're thinking, the other experts will bet on whether or not the expert knows the answer. And we're going to start now with the player with the lowest score, Raj. That means it's you. This is your first question. What two NFL teams play in stadiums named after their team mascot? Quick response there, Jesse. You thought he'd know it or not know it right away. John, you have your guess in? Change? Coming back? Okay. Don't change it. And Raj, we're ready for an answer. Yeah. Okay, got the Ravens and the Dolphins. The Ravens and the Dolphins. That answer is incorrect. <laughs> And John said it would be right, and Jessa <laughs> said it would be right. They, <laughs> everybody loses the, the correct answer. The correct answer: the Cleveland Browns play in Brown Stadium, and the Dallas Cowboys play in no. Cowboys What's Stadium. Brown? Jessa, this is your first question. From left to right, give the order of the boys on the No Strings Attached album cover. From left to right, John, do you just happen to know this offhand? <laughs> Boy, oh boy, I think it's Chris, Justin, Lance, Joey, JC. That is incorrect. Wow, both of yeah, John and Rod. Oh, five God. points. The answer, Joey, Chris, oh. Justin, JC, oh, and Lance. How do you miss that? John, in what episode do Daenerys and her Kalasar travel to Karth, or Quarth, where they are nearly turned away to perish in the surrounding desert? Look at the way you're looking at John, Jessa. Look at that study. Do you think he's got it there? No. It's tough to tell. John, we're ready for your answer. Oh. The Garden of Bones. The Garden of Bones is the correct answer. Oh, well. He got it right. Raj, oh, unfortunately, right. doesn't get it. But Jessa gets five points, and John gets five points. In NFL, 21st century NFL, what 2002 team beat the Pittsburgh Steelers 24 to 6 despite amassing only 47 yards of total offense. Jessa and John look like they're already in with their guesses. Your answer, Raj. I say the Baltimore Ravens. It's the Houston Texans. John said you get it wrong. Jessa yeah, said you get it right. And Jessa, here's the question. <clears throat> what band member once told an interviewer the be the beginning of the shows are different? One time we'll say, hello, Denver. Another time we'll say, hello, Memphis. It's always different. <laughs> Jessa? Seems like it would be JC. It really does seem like it would be JC. But it's not, is but it? But it's Lance. Oh, Lance! Lance! You said she'd get it right. Raj said she'd get it right. <laughs> no harm, no foul. The last question goes to John. John, a question from Game of Thrones. What four animals representing the noble houses of Westeros are seen at the corners of the Game of Thrones logo? Hmm. Four animals. They're so looking at you. Right now, you, you seem like you're acting. You may be stumped. John, what are those four animals? That's going to be the Stark Wolf, the Lannister Lion, the Baratheon Stag, and the Targaryen Dragon. And that is about as correct as a man can get. They both thought you'd get it right, five across the board. <laughs> Coming up, round four will determine the expert of experts who will then go on to answer the hardest question in the world.